All right, everyone, welcome to a brand new video. Now, as I said last video, I said the next video that we're going to do is is going to be cleaning my car. So that's what we're going to be doing today, and I'm going to be showing you how to do it by using a special like, machine thing to basically, after you've washed it, you rinse over, and then basically it leaves no watermark, so it's completely clean and like shiny afterwards. Um, but yeah, the reason we're doing this video is because a guy commented saying that my car was so dirty that I needed to scrap any mods and just buy a Dyson Hoover. So, um, but yeah, let's start the car, go over to where we're going to be cleaning it, uh, and get all the stuff out as well. Okay, so we have got everything. We've got the bucket with the sponges in there. The extension cable to plug in the jet wash. The this is the thing that will stop all the like water marks on the car afterwards. You spray it all over the car, just normal water. It's like a special special lot filters that water goes through, and then it comes out perfectly clear, with no things in it to stop all the all the stuff on the car. And then yeah, the hose, and that is it. We're ready to clean the car. Um, it's gonna be like a quick clean because as you can see the sun is going down so I don't know how long we have but yeah let me know down in the comments if you give me any give me any advice if I've done something wrong or you do something differently uh, or there's a way to speed things up let me know down below but uh, yeah let's let's turn all the jet wash on give it a rinse and let's start the clean Okay, so I've now given the whole car just a rinse down with a jet wash, just plain and simple. Yeah, now that's all done. Moving on to the snow foam, which I've got just there. I've put the snow foam attached to the end of the jet wash. And then, yeah, I snow foam the whole car and then I basically go over it with a sponge um, just to make it nice and quick. Sometimes if I'm feeling to do it properly, properly, then I'll do like a panel at a time, and like snow foam it, then wash it down then so the bowls don't set. But because I'm going to be doing it quite quick, um, we're going to just do the whole car and then basically give the whole car a quick like sponge down and then yeah okay so the snow foam is on all over the car and we are now going to just let it settle for about literally a minute and then we'll go over it with a, with a sponge all over and then yeah we'll rinse it off and then this is where that machine right there comes in and then we rinse all the car over with that and then it should stop all the water from settling on the car but yeah i've now been, what the f yeah i've now gone over the whole car well, the sponge uh, and now we're going to literally rinse off of the cold water and then we're going to attach the other hose thing to rinse it all down again okay mind the mess but the way this thing works right so this is the pure water system and basically the normal hose that you have runs into the bottom of that and then you get another separate hose just like this one that you carry around with you and spray the water on and that connects to the top and basically the normal water goes in through all these filters in the middle and comes out this one pure so when we spray it on there it will leave no marks whatsoever so it's all turned on um and yeah let's get started make sure when you finish with it you close that valve this thing twists here so that's on at the moment just open then twist the side to close it and also you get this yellow yellow thing here, which when you take this out, plugs into there to stop it all leaking out. But uh, yeah, let's get going. Okay, with this one, I'd recommend the cloud setting because it doesn't build up that much pressure. So this is a really thin hose compared to normal to build up the pressure. And then it just comes like that and literally spray that all over the car and then it will dry perfectly. Okay, so that is basically, I've done, what what I've done with the car is basically gone over just the windows and any gloss black bits, any plastic, anything like that, gone over the windows and then that will dry perfectly, but 
of you don't really need to go for it the, the body like the body will dry fine it depends what color car you have like some cars you'll really notice it drying so you have to do the whole car but i've actually done the lights wheels windows and any glass black bits and then that would be fine but yeah like i said you can do the whole car but i'll show you the results when that is completely dry um but yeah i think it's time to move on to the inside okay so mine all my stuff but the inside of this car is actually pretty dirty so you've got this no uh, this is this is a little bit before and after you know in the back this is what i noticed in, in, in the video right all of that on the seat that i don't see i mean this the mats aren't they're not awful but it's not great does it it, it needs to be done but it's just stuff like i'll wipe all that off make it all nice inside and uh yeah let's get on cleaning this thing all right we are losing light it's getting dark but from the bits that you can see where it's dried so far it there is no mock stuff it's still dry at the moment but i wanted to show you why we can still see again here with the bits where it has dried it's dried perfectly um and it's going to be the same around the rest of the car but i've already given the mats a little hoover they're all nice and clean but we still got all this to do and then we'll wipe off this and then we'll be done But yeah, alright everyone, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. The car is now looking all nice and clean inside and out. All the foot, the foot well is looking good. And the outside of the car as well. Not dried yet. But it looks nice. Look at that. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. And also check out all our social medias as well down below in the description. Uh, follow us on Instagram that I'd really really appreciate it and also yeah give us a subscribe as well but um yeah also let me know in the comments anything you would do differently to what I did like if it can speed up in any way if it's just a better way to clean a car but yeah thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one